Welcome to Ultimate Autographs. You have found the internet's best live break room featuring signed sports memorabilia and autographed sports cards inside the most exciting mystery boxes. If you're new to breaking with us, we can help break it down to make it as easy as possible to understand. First, head to the live break page and look for a series that suits your interests. Most of the series will have eight spots, which represent the eight NFL divisions, but other sports breaks or mixers may vary. If you purchase one spot, that means you have a one in eight chance to win an item at an extremely discounted rate. Then click add to cart to purchase your live break spot. Once you have completed your checkout, tune into the next available live breaks broadcast on Facebook, Twitch, or YouTube at 7 p.m. Central Time any day of the week or 4 p.m. on weekdays along with 2 p.m. on weekends. As you watch, you will see your name appear on the screen. When your specific break begins, your name will go into the randomizer and will be randomized a specific amount of times based on that evening's dice roll number. Once the randomization is over, the list of names of people that bought into that live break will be matched up with a specific division. If the item that is pulled from the mystery box matches your division, congratulations. You just won an incredible piece of signed memorabilia that will be shipped straight to your door. Want to guarantee yourself an item as opposed to testing your luck? Most of the series that you see on the live break page can be purchased under the mystery box tab of our website. Those boxes can either be shipped directly to your door or opened on the air before being sent to you. While you are there, make sure to sign up for our signature points club. This exclusive club earns you points towards specific discounts, signed items, or exclusive events each and every time you buy at ultimateautographs.com. Well, the time has finally come. Let's get break. Hello and welcome to Ultimate Autographs. I'm Common here with Steven. We're getting ready for a great show. A lot of good stuff in the room. We have 11 boxes left in the replica helmets. Four headliners still out there. We are close to closing out the minis. Andy Naughty or Nice jerseys. Fresh series coming up as soon as we close those. Four to go in the footballs, too. Eric Dickerson out there. New series coming when that's closed. All headliners out there in the Authentics. Brand new series in the room. Black and blue. All headliners out there. New series in the room. That one is heating up, Stephen. Loaded dice. Best series we have here. Uh, Peyton Manning, Flash Authentic out there. We've got Randy Moss, Flash Authentic. Have a lot of good stuff in the room. Uh, day off for you yesterday on Monday. Uh, how are you doing today, Steve? Doing good, Common. Well rested. Spent some time with family for the holidays, so ready to rip some boxes. That's always good. All righty, folks. Uh, we've got black and blue number one: Kevin Finn, Travis Weaver, David Fru, Robert Shaw, Ralph Fonaro, Chris Leonard, Chris Distasio. Drop me a box number. Uh, otherwise, I can randomize. What's going on, Manny? Manny, saying afternoon. Uh, big win for Manny's Packers yesterday, Stephen. Mm. He was a happy camper. The slim playoff hopes are still alive. Emphasis on the slim. Uh, all righty, dice roller going up, looking for six or higher. Four and a four, eight's going to do on the dice roll. Let's see uh, what our wheel of names is going to be. What's the chase item today? Uh, let's see. Load, load. Come on, wheel of names. Uh, here we go. What are we chasing this program? We've got, this will be close, Steven. I think it's going to stick on the jerseys, though. So, naughty or nice jerseys are the chase. So, any break that fills up in that, we'll get you in on the chase wheel spin. Uh, we only have four of those jerseys left. So, we can only have, at the most, 32 names in there. I know we're really close on the first jersey break. So, we'll have at least eight names in the chase wheel spin. So, uh, go back, go, says Manny. I made the mistake of, uh, betting on the Rams to cover last night, Stephen. Uh, I told you this off, off air. NFL betting has not been good. Uh, football, college football, NBA, World Cup, fantastic. Eastern Michigan plus four and a half. I have today. They're up thirty to thirteen with less than a minute to go in the first half. Looking so good. that one's looking good at least. Uh, so black and blue. We have three black and blues ready to go. One authentic ready to go. Uh, we dropped those series both after 10 p.m. last night. So every Ooh. headliner's out there. We've done two boxes in black and blue, but all the headliners out there. We got Ralph saying go Vikes. Ralph, what a comeback, man. Uh, what a comeback by the Vikings. 
literally statistically the largest comeback in NFL history at halftime. Down 33 to 0. A lot of good Vikings in the room. Randy Moss and Loaded Dice. Adrian Peterson in the replica helmets. We are full of Vikings in here. Uh, all righty, Steven. I'm getting this randomizer prepped for our black and blue. Uh, we'll let the randomizer pick the box number here. Did a couple of these yesterday. Looking forward to doing a bunch more of these. Want to do a lot of our other series, too. Uh, randomizer's up. So the black and blue, full disclosure, guys. Uh, those are items who have imperfections. So... Uh, we do have a few that are simply perfect items on new teams like Devontae Adams and Tyree Kill. Uh, but you're paying for what you get in this series. So if it's smudges, no certs, uh, stuff like that, that's why it's 20 bucks a spot. Uh, so just know these are not in pristine condition. Everything else in all our other series is in pristine condition. Uh, so we, we have a lot of, um, take a lot of pride in having items that are good. So if we put them in our other series, uh, they're just about perfect. All right, did, you think, did we get a box number? Uh, we're about to here. Six, seven, and eight, box 10, Steven. Okay. Just kidding. Bobby Shaw coming in at the last second. Uh, he wants seven. Seven will do, Bobby. Good. Seven going off the ticker. If you're in the second black and blue, I will also take a box number because that one is also full. As is the third one. We'll do the third one after uh, and the, fourth the authentic. One. And the fourth one. Okay, all right. Well, hey, <laughs> uh, if you have box numbers for those, call it out. Uh, but let's go with the second one first. If you're in the second one, drop in your box number and let me know. Uh, put break two. Yes. So there's no confusion. Seven and eight clicks. We have Ralph up top in the NFC North. Bobby Shaw's got the NFC South. It's Kevin Finn in the NFC East. Uh, then we have David in the NFC West. We got Chris in the AFC North, AFC South. We got Travis AFC East, Chris AFC West. So Ethan wants four and black and blue two. Uh, so Matt, you were a little bit behind him. Manny as well, a little bit behind. Ethan was first for the second one. Here we go. Box seven out of 40 in the black and blue. Let me get this chase item up, which is the jerseys. Break is going to be... Pretty popular, it looks like, Steve. I think so. Looking very popular at the moment. Got a mini helmet here. Uh, this man led the league in receiving touchdowns for the Chiefs back in the day. Back before they were winning Super Bowls, this was actually one of their best offensive players. We have Dwayne Bow on the flash mini helmet for the Chiefs. And there are just some scuffs on the top of the mini helmet. Uh, so you can kind of see it in the light there. Uh, just little scuffs, little scratches. It's actually pretty minor, Stephen. A little scratch here as well. It is on the, uh, and the auto's got a little scuff on top of it. So a couple minor scuffs and scratches. Uh, but congrats, Chris Destacio, on the Dwayne Bow Flash Mini Helmet. Okay, Chris. Uh, nicely done, sir. That is JSA certified. Uh, what's up, guys? New here, but hope I hit something for my first time. Uh, break number four. Awesome. Welcome, welcome. Bang Chi. Welcome to the break room. Let us know how you heard about Ultimate Autographs and what your favorite squad is as well. So, Chris, starting with the Dwayne Bow Flash Mini. All right. So, all the imperfections and all the items in this series are in the listing. So, it makes it nice and simple. So second black and blue will be box four. Steven's already got it ready. Thank you, Steven. Uh, we will keep rocking and rolling here. So black and blue two, let's see. We've got Ralph, Ethan, Ethan, Chris, Michael, and Nicholas. Okay, so a lot of uh, pretty common names. You know, my name's not in there. That's an uncommon one. So let's see what we got in... The next one, Stephen, if you can hand me that box. Thank you, sir. Ooh, this one's a little bit heavier. It's 31. Yeah, a little bit heavier. We have reps in this series, authentics, minis, jerseys, uh, you name it, we've got it. Randomizer back up, eight clicks. Here we go for our divisions, folks. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Uh, see a lip ride before just decided to join on the first time says chi there you go 
Uh, well, good. Glad you're in. Ethan Williams has the NFC North. We got Michael in the NFC South. Uh, then we've got Ralph in the NFC East. Nicholas, NFC West. Chris, AFC North. Nicholas, AFC South. Ralph, AFC East. And Ethan, AFC West. Let's keep it rolling here. What could we have in this next break? Box four out of 40 in the black and blue. It's a fun series. It's definitely a fun series. Yes, it is. Seven in the hurt so good, says Ethan. And Matt wants 12 in break three for the black and blue. We can do both of those. Oh, my. This right here is uh, quite the hit, Steven. Quite the hit. Uh, we've got a legendary quarterback. College Football Hall of Famer won the Super Bowl and the 1983 NFL MVP Joe Theismann on the Washington uh, football team Ooh, Flash Replica nice. Helmet. 83 MVP. Uh, what in the world is wrong with this? Let's take a peek at the listing. Maybe it's the cert card. Although, is it Beckett certified? It is Beckett certified. So it's not the cert card. Uh, I can't tell off the top of my head. What's wrong with? So I'm going to go straight to the listing and find out. Manny saying, welcome, Chi. Good luck. Uh, absolutely. Good luck to everyone. Old and new bolt. Yeah, off the top of my head, Steven, I don't see a lick wrong with this helmet. Did we put it in here on accident? Uh, let me take a peek at what the listing says. A nice accident. Uh, could be a nice accident. Joe Theismann, uh, paint issue. So it says it on here, commander's glass replica helmet, even though it's actually... Washington football team, but paint issue. Oh, maybe this is it here at the very top of the helmet. Very, my very minor paint issue. You actually really can't see it on the stream, but this one is the cleanest one so far I pulled in the black and blue. So, congratulations, Ralph. Uh, you are taking home the Joe Theismann, sir. Okay. Okay, Ralph. We see you. Ralph with a dub. A Ralph Aneda. So we have the Hurt So Good Authentic next. Uh, we'll do box seven, right? Seven yes, for Ethan. Seven. Box seven, yes, sir. I'll take those two boxes. Sounds good, Steven. Get you the first one here. Let me write up the second one real quick. And then we'll do box seven in the Authentics. Then we'll do box 12 in the third black and blue. So we are uh, moving pretty quickly here. Breaks are filling. You guys are loving what we got. How could we blame you? We got a lot of Six good stuff. Alive. Six, so five filled out as well. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That series won't last long, Steven. It will not. It will not last long. This will not be here forever. Uh, so, Hurt So Good Authentics. Number seven. Uh, who's left an extra point when you get a set, Colin? I can tell you right now, we have 11 boxes to go. Four headliners left. That is Adrian Peterson, Tiki Barber, and the Diggs brothers. Both Trayvon and stefan Diggs, so a lot of goodies uh out there in that. that series yes thank you sorry steven what's up natron he's back have you guys uh, done a jersey break from last night yet uh not yet natron one away one away that's close natron was named after natron means and i'm not joking this time steven you he told us about it yesterday it was actually pretty cool that's a nice name uh very nice name uh, so he's a Ravens fan, but also likes Natron means. Randomizer going up. Eight clicks here, and the hurt's so good, authentic. Let's see some heat here. Six, seven, and eight. We've got Edward Tabanera up top in the NFC North, followed by Chris Destacio in the NFC South, Travis Honga in the NFC East, Edward NFC West, Ethan AFC North, Chris AFC South. Matthew AFC East and Matthew AFC West. Hurt so good. Authentics number one. Named after Jalen Hurts, who is, by the way, on an Oklahoma authentic in this series, Stephen. Little OU Sooner action okay. uh, for the quarterback, who is, according to the betting favorites, uh, the leading MVP candidate this season. Mm -hmm. So very good player. Looking forward to a lot of heat in this series. Here we go. Box seven. Coming up, first break in this series. Let's get it started the right way. Unlike the black and blue, these helmets are all in perfect shape. The best part about it, Steven, 
they're all authentic mm. every single one is authentic in this series my favorite kind of helmet we got a good start uh we have darius or right now shaquille leonard uh you know what they call him steven no oh. the maniac oh that's what they call him it's right there on the helmet maniac inscription one of the best defensive players in the league four seasons uh three-time first team all pro three-time pro bowler nfl defensive rookie of the year at one point led the league in tackles one season force fumbles another uh he's been injured this season i'm willing to bet if he had played in that game against the vikings that comeback would not have happened yeah I he would not have stood for it the highest paid linebacker in the nfl Congratulations, Chris Distasio. Let's go. Ah, there you go, Chris. Nicely done on that hit. A uh, full-sized authentic lunar. Uh, glasses are off, Colin Pelletier. That's right. It's been a week since my eye infection. They told me one week without contacts. And I went eight days just to be safe yesterday. There you go. So glasses are off. Contacts feel good. My eye feels good. Uh, so... Things are back to normal, Steven. I don't mind the glasses look, but sometimes they get foggy. Sometimes they get pressed up on you. I do prefer the, I guess, the freedom of the contacts. Yeah. So. I do too. Yeah. Just a little bit nicer. Although glasses are good late at night when you don't want to, like, take off your contacts. So you want to, like, lay in bed before uh, going to bed, and glasses do the trick as well. So congrats, Chris, on Leonard. We have the black and blue number three. I think that's box 12 called out by Matthew Ludwig. And I think it's black and blue four and black and blue five. Yep. So, Stephen, we'll pass this. We'll, we'll get a better hit. But let's put this here for now. Leader in the clubhouse for hit of the day. Very early in the show. Very, very early in the show here today. So, I'll get these guys randomized for the divisions. We'll do box 12. I think it's box, though. So. Yep, that works. Uh, yesterday, Travis Honga was in the room. Uh, we were talking about how he's much more reserved than David Honga. Mm. He popped in the chat. He's like, yep, I have a lot more quiet than my brother. That was funny. Um, Ooh, uh, look at this. We have a special request, even. Oh, we don't have 12 yet available, Matthew Ludwig. Uh, so we currently have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8, and 10. So we don't have 12 actually available yet. Uh, that will be available soon. We'll bring some more in the room, but uh, rules are rules. It's not on the ticker. I can't make that exception yet. Uh, so let me know on a box number. We don't special have to request from who? Yeah. Oh, special request from Colin to see Stephen's Christmas gifts for you. Oh, well. So we'll show that off as soon as Chris pops in the chat. Yep. I want, Chris, I want to be Chris to be here. We want Chris to be here for it. Uh, it's It's pretty good, though. It's pretty good. So drop me one more number here, guys. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and eight. So let me know which one of those works. Ethan wants 42 on the Naughty or Nice jerseys. 42 will work, Ethan. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I didn't realize we didn't have 12 yet when Matt called it out. So that is Dave, Charles, Michael, Matt, and Travis. Let me know on a black and blue number three. Uh, let me know what you're feeling on the box number. So looking forward to a lot of fun. Steven, I didn't get a chance to tell you this. Uh, one says Matt. All right, one will do Matt. One going off the ticker. Uh, so, Steven, we'll talk about this a little later in the show when we get a little more time. We'll take a close peek. But we got the one seed in the UA Fantasy League by less than two points. Oh. It was a tiebreaker. Brandon Glenn had about one point something less points than us and then travis isaacs hit about 16 17 less than us Ooh. we had a three-way tie for first and everyone Ooh. was super close wow we did get the one seed uh so good old one seed good old one seed one out of 40 here in the black and blue uh, let's see dave bechtel we can do five for the next one dave dave asking for five dave is in black and blue number four yeah, that's fine so we'll do five for the next one. That's going off the ticker as well. I think it's a 40-box series, Steven. Don't know that it's going to last very long. Well, who's going to last the show? Number six is sold. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so let me get through these pretty quickly here then because you guys are absolutely dominating this break. 
Uh, let's get through these pretty quickly here. Seven and eight clicks. Got Dave Bechtel up top in the NFC North, uh, followed by Charles Brown in the NFC South. We got Dave in the NFC East. Matthew's got the NFC West, AFC North, Travis AFC South, Matthew AFC East, and Michael AFC West. All righty. What could we have in here? One out of 40 in the black and blue. See this one a little, a little light. Might be another mini helmet. Might be a slab card. Or it could be a jersey, Steven. Actually, it's a jersey, I think. Uh, what do we have in here? Got ourselves uh, one of the best defensive backs in chief history. How about a little cherry in your life? Duran Cherry. Okay. PSA certified on Mr. Cherry. Uh, let's see. What is wrong with Mr. Duran Cherry? He's an outstanding individual, isn't he? Uh, he is a good guy. Nothing wrong with him. The jersey has uh, a few, like, black marks. It's a little, mm. a little dirty. I don't know. It is white. So if you bleach this, maybe it won't be as dirty. But Duran Cherry, that's the AFC West. We got Michael Francia. Uh, congrats, Michael, on the Duran Cherry. Okay, cool. Nicely done, sir. Uh, that's how we do it. That was number three we did, right? Duran Cherry. There you go. Chris is here uh, for now for about 15 minutes, but I can come back at 7 if Steven's still offering his services at that time. Why don't you come back at 7, Chris, because we have a bunch of breaks that are about to fill up, right? Yeah, I mean, they're already filled up. Yeah, they're already filled up. So breaks are the priority. Uh, Chris will definitely take a look at that gift. Uh, Colin asking for a double. Steven, I'm almost tempted to just do a double in black and blue. Uh, I know these guys, sometimes we do a double and a single, but it's selling out so quickly that uh, it's, it's a little complicated if we have both, right? What do you yeah. think? I mean... At the price point, I think just a double would be... Yeah, if you guys want to do just a double, let me know. Uh, otherwise, I guess we'll keep rolling for the single for now, because it's filling so quickly. Uh, but maybe we can do a double box break. Let me know if you guys would prefer a single or a double. Because this is like flying off the shelf. It's going to get crazy complicated if we have both a single and double at the same time. If you guys would prefer a double, let me know. If you guys would prefer a single, let me know. At least till we get caught up here, we're going to stick with the single, you know. And uh, then we can move to a double once we get caught up. Cameron may just wear it around. Might as well, man. Might as well. Since it's go. got a small smudge, uh, you don't want to frame this one. Might as well wear it around. Double sounds good, says Adam, okay. So, he, Steven, let's plan on this. Once we get caught up here, uh, we'll move to a double. Out, and seven sells out. Yeah, so... Yeah, black and blue four is next. Yeah, double will save you randomizing fingers. I agree, Colin. So we'll plan on a double uh, once we get caught up here with a few of these singles. I, I hope so, Don Beluso. I know personally I am gifting myself a Leo Messi jersey for Christmas uh, with the three stars. Uh, I know those are just getting built, so it's probably not going to be ready yet. Uh, but... It'll be like after Christmas, I'll give it to myself. I don't think we're getting any signed Messi jerseys because his autograph on average is worth more than Brady. So you guys, I know I love soccer. You guys probably uh, don't love Messi as much as Brady. So it, it's it's a tough thing to get in the break room, but hopefully we can get it at some point. Uh, we've got, I know we've had him on a slap card, but non-autograph slap card. Messi autograph, I mean, obviously, Stephen, it makes sense. I know America is the biggest for breaks but with that said messi is way more bigger than brady on the worldwide well i know that yeah so it makes sense that the autograph is very very expensive uh what do we have black and blue four we actually had box five from dave in black and blue four okay manny wants two though but manny we did have a box already called out from dave he wanted five Hopefully we get some Leo Messi up in here in good time, Stephen. That's the goal. Here you go. Thank you, sir. I would love a Messi cleat. If I could pick, someone asked me this question uh, the other day. I can't remember if you're here, Stephen, for it. 
But they asked me if you could have any Messi memorabilia, what would you want it on? I'd want it on a cleat. Soccer cleat. I think that would be very cool. Either that or a ball. Yeah, a ball would be good as well. Robert Shaw up top in the NFC North. The jersey I'd want to wear. So that's why I'll, I'll buy an unsigned jersey. Uh, Manny's got the NFC South. Chi's in the NFC East. First break ever for Chi. We got Michael, NFC West. Uh, we have Dustin, AFC North. Dave, AFC South. Dave, AFC East. And Dustin, AFC West. Depends on where you look, Bob. Bob's saying the sign Messi is about $1,400. The Brady's about $2,000. Uh, I've seen different. Like, they're roughly similar. I've also seen signed Messi jerseys for, like, ten grand online. So it really depends on what type of jersey you're getting. But the whole point is that it's in the same ballpark of a Brady, whether it's worth a little more or less. Uh, obviously, I, I hope you guys like Messi better, but I'm also honest. You guys like Brady more, to be honest. If you'd want it on a World Cup ball, that'd be nice as well. Uh, five out of 40. I know, Steven, you're big on slab cards. Uh, there's a Messi card that I just saw recently that was worth $500,000. Oh, yeah. So... <laughs> Cards, are, Cards are definitely ball have game. a different ballgame for sure. Well, well, well. We have got ourselves our first headliner off the board. And guess what, Steven? There's exactly zero, nada, zilch wrong with it. It's only in the black and blue because this man is on a new team. We got a Tyree Kill Chiefs football, Ooh. the fastest receiver in the league, second in the NFL uh, in receiving yards right now. Six seasons in Kansas City, six Pro Bowls. Uh, obviously, a guy who consistently gets over a thousand yards. Won a Super Bowl, had a big catch in that game. PSA certified on the beautiful Tyree Kill. Nicely done, Dustin. That's how we do it. The cheetah. Very nice. And liner off the board, Stephen. Uh, fantastic, right there. Uh, Dom wants a dual Messi and Ronaldo signed ball, Dom. You like it could be good for you personally i think having ronaldo on the same piece of memorabilia as messi just makes it messy for me i would much rather have just ronaldo i think i want it mbappe okay mbappe mbappe is good too but I, I don't like he's not as bad as ronaldo but his attitude uh not my favorite uh he was trolled by argentina's goalie at the parade today because mbappe a few months ago said uh, that Argentina and Brazil were not going to win the World Cup because uh, the European teams play better competition. They're more ready. They're more seasoned. Uh, and he was getting trolled because man had to eat his words. Had to eat oh, his words. That goes down. Mbappe is a spectacular player. Uh, but his humble nature, nothing like Messi's. Uh, he's very similar to Ronaldo in many ways, uh, both playing style and... Also, I guess his general attitude. Uh, very good player. Just not my cup of tea, Steven. I'm a messy Neymar guy. Mbappe, not my favorite. Oh, gosh. Uh, is Mbappe second for what? Maybe he's second best player in the world right now. I don't know. Although Mbappe, believe it or not, Steven, if we add up goals and assists, he's got the third most total goals and assists on his team. He has more total goals than Messi and Neymar, but he's actually, if you add up their assists, he's third on his own team in goal contributions for the club season. Mm. Uh, but definitely put on a show in the World Cup. Uh, so, black and blue number five is next. Adam Cantwell, Michael Francia, Dave Bechtel, Raymond Lowe. Let me know uh, on a box number. Vinny's out here just trolling right now. Okay, Vinny. Okay. Uh, so... Adam, Michael, Dave, Raymond, let me know on a number. Three, four, and eight available. Steven, we'll do three, four, and eight in this break. Uh, but when you get a second, if you can bring some more, and I'll add 11 through 15 for now in the black and blue. Which one are we doing for this one, though? Uh, let's see. Three, four, eight. Uh, OG Brazil Ronaldo is the second best player I've seen. Uh, I know Pele and Maradona might be better, but... Uh, behind Messi, the OG Brazilian Ronaldo, second best player I've ever seen. One of my favorite athletes when I first started watching the beautiful game. I'm going to get this randomizer prep. Three, four, and eight. If not heard on a box number, we'll do one of those here. Oh, let's keep it rolling. Is there four in the room? There might be one more number. That I took off. 
pick eight off the ticker. Thank you, Adam. But what are the numbers there? Two, three, eight, and ten. Oh, okay. So, oh, yeah, that's right. We took ten back. Two, three, eight, and ten. So ten is out there as well. Roberto Baggio was great, Italian legend. Uh, missed that penalty kick in the 94 World Cup final. So we'll do box eight, called out by Adam. Thank you, Adam. Hey, Adam got a good bet today. Eastern Michigan plus four and a half against San Jose State. They're up 30 to 13 at the half. So very good. Uh, oh, there you go. Uh, Bob went to dinner with a friend and Carlos Alberto when he was on the Cosmos. Pele was also on the Cosmos as well. Five, six, seven, and eight clicks. We've got Adam Cantwell up top in the NFC North. Raymond Lowe in the NFC South. Uh, then we've got Raymond in the NFC East. Dave's got the NFC West. And then we have... Michael in the AFC North, Dave AFC South, Raymond AFC East, and AFC West is Raymond as well. Black and blue, 8 out of 40. So we got a couple boxes. 13 for black and blue, 6. 12 for black and blue, 7. That's Colin. Okay, that works. Get both of those knocked out here. All righty. I think it's another jersey here. We've got another jersey. Got a little Sam Hubbard action here in the break room. Let's see what's wrong with the Sam Hubbard jersey. It's an Ohio State jersey. So let me take a peek at what our listing says on the Sam Hubbard jersey and what exactly is wrong with it. Uh, talented defensive end, by the way, plays for the Bengals. Uh, an absolute beast, 27 and a half career sacks so far in his career. Uh, third round pick out of 20, 2018 out of Ohio State. Former second team, all Big Ten guy, uh, Sam Hubbard, Ohio State jersey. So let's see what is wrong on this listing. Sam Hubbard, I'll pull it up for you guys as well. It's an AFC North hit. By the way, that's Michael Francia. Sam Hubbard. Uh, certification issue. Actually, I think we just don't have the cert card. That's the only issue with this one. We do have the JSA sticker, but not the matching card. AFC North, Michael Francia. Okay, Michael. Uh, this series is just moving. Sam Hubbard. Sam Hubbard. Play that on your second favorite team, or maybe your favorite now, Stephen. Do I dare say it? My Super Bowl favorite. Your Super Bowl favorite. I the have Bengals. one team that's just out of it, one team that could win it, and one team that might make the playoffs. Okay. Uh... I'm one, about the same way. Level. One at each level. Yeah, I got the Chiefs, and then we both got the Bears. The Bengals are your Super Bowl squad. Chiefs are mine. I don't know if I have a third team. I don't know if I have an adopted the team. Third, the my, my adopted team is the Dolphins, because I did predict them to make the playoffs before the, playoffs. the season. So well, we're in the same boat. We've got the that. Chargers. The Jaguars. Oh, Jaguars. That's right. Jaguars. Jaguars might steal a four seed, though. They could. They could. Uh, they beat the Titans head-to-head -head the next game. They've got the tiebreaker. Congrats, Michael, on the Sam Hubbard. Another really good player. I know we talked about this the other day, but that Bengals defense, it's not full of all pro players, but it's full of, like, really good players. Basically, like, Messi supporting cast in Argentina. He's the one big star name, and the other 10 guys are all, like, very, very good. Like Giannis in the Bucks. Mm -hmm. A lot of very, very good players. Not necessarily top 10 players in the league, uh, but sometimes having one superstar and very good players around them, that's all you need. It's all you need. It's all you need. Uh, black and blue five is next. Or actually, excuse me, black and blue. Actually, it won't be black and blue. We have Naughty or Nice Jerseys one, then we have black and blue six afterwards. And we'll have black and blue seven. Yeah, and seven. We have... actually we have the extra point in between that. Okay. We got 42 on the Naughty or Nice Jersey, Steven. Okay. Uh, I know that Ethan Williams called it out a little earlier. So, let me refresh the break page. You want to make the next one a double? I can. Uh, let's do black and blue. Uh, we'll call it black and blue. I guess you might as well call it black and blue eight, even though it's double. So, we're going to do one. Let's call it black and blue eight and make it a double box break. Okay. Uh, that way, we can knock out two birds with one stone. Uh, if you guys 
uh, are having issues uh, with the double, we can go back to a single. But let's try a double for now. Uh, so Devin Butterworth, unfortunately, our fear, fearless leader, Matt Salas, our owner, is under the weather. So we did not have our meeting today. We're going to skip it for this week. Uh, I'll probably meet with them later this week, and we will get you more info on the iconic stuff. But uh, obviously, he's got a sore throat. Couldn't meet. We don't want to get sick. Uh, so no update on that one, Devin, because our meeting, actually, our meeting was supposed to be Monday. 41? Uh, 42. Got moved to Tuesday, and Matt is still under the weather. But we'll have an update as soon as we have one, Devin. Five, six, seven, and eight. But what we had discussed in the past is doing that early on in January. So, and then having it for all the folks who are iconic for this year. That's probably what we're going to do, but I don't want to promise you anything. We'll get back to you on that one. Uh, all right, not your nice jerseys on the way. Michael Foster, uh, you've got the NFC North, Ethan, NFC South, Natron, NFC East. We got Jerome, NFC West, Ethan, AFC North. And it's Brogan, one of my favorite names in the break room in the AFC South, Adam AFC East, and Chris AFC West. Uh, that's right. You never got your Zoom link, Vinny, because there was never a meeting. Uh, Vinny wants to represent the people, Stephen, in uh, our meeting. <laughs> I, I told him not going to happen, but he's persistent. He's persistent. Uh, 42 of 45 here in not your nice jersey. You can represent the people right where you're at. Okay. Uh, well, Chris Testacio has already won tonight, right? He's already won earlier. He's going to get another one. Uh, great Hall of Fame receiver, part of the Air Coriel offense, Charlie Joyner. JSA certified on Charlie Joyner. Congrats, Chris Testacio, on the beautiful blue Charger jersey, Charlie Joyner. Uh, let's see if you're naughty or nice. We're down to seven total boxes of naughty or nice. Three bonus prizes left. Naughty, no bonus prize here. So one in two chance, I believe, at a bonus prize. Uh, what headliners are left in the mixer, Robert asks? I'm guessing he's talking about black and blue, right, Steven? Uh, I'm guessing so. I think so. Every headliner but the Tyree Kill football, sir. The Cheetah football is off the board. Uh, so, Chris, congrats on Charlie Joyner. Yes, all the headliners, Robert. The mixer, as I mentioned earlier, uh, is items that have uh, most of the items, like the Tyree Kill Authentic, new team. Devontae Adams rep, new team, perfect condition. Uh, however, there are items in there that have some imperfect imperfections. That's why it's 20 bucks. So you might get yourself uh, Barry Sanders and it would have some issues with it, for example. If you're comfortable with that, uh, there's no better price point than 20 bucks. So. Hop in there if you would like. All the issues are also in the listing, so no one can complain because it says that they're in the listing exactly what's wrong with all the names in there. Speaking of black and blue, number six is next. Uh, we have box 13, and Nick Ortega's in here. 13 uh, going off the ticker in the black and blue. So we'll do 13. I think Steven, oh, you did get a chance to go in the back. Yeah. Perfect. So lucky number 13 is coming. Meetings are typically Mondays, Finny Batani. Uh, I probably should not have said that. He's probably going to try to, like, hack in or something, Steven. You might. You might try and hack in. But I think we, we're not having it this week, uh, so maybe next Monday. But I'll, I'll see if I can get word on that iconic stuff before that if I can. So uh, 13, Steven, in the yep. black and blue. Box 13 coming up. I'll get you guys randomized for your divisions. Travis, Ethan, Chris, Nick, Robert, Peter, Michael. Let's go, folks. Let's see some heat in the break room. Pick some of those. Yes, sir. Go black and blue action. The 40 box series, Steven, I think it's going to be gone tonight. It could be. I think it's going to be gone tonight. Uh, 13 out of 40. Good luck, folks. Let's see some more heat. When is the full size, says Ask Mel Boone. Uh, the full size replica, I'm guessing, is next, Mel, actually. Yep. Mm -hmm. That is the very next break that's coming up as soon as we knock out this black and blue number six. 
All right, Robert Shaw up top of the NFC North. We got Ethan, NFC South, Michael, NFC East, Chris, NFC West, Nick, AFC North, Ethan, AFC South, Peter, AFC East, and Travis, AFC West. Black and blue, 13. Here we go. What could we have in lucky number 13? Extra point. It's next, Mel. Coming up next. Uh, that's the break that I'd be playing. I know these guys like this one, Steven. Uh, but the headliner probabilities are so high in the extra point. That's where I'm headed. Got a mini helmet here. Ooh, we got a good one. We got a good one. Three-time Super Bowl champion receiver, Pro Football Hall of Famer. He was a beast at the U before that. Michael Irvin, Miami Hurricane mini helmet. That is beautiful. NFC East, Michael Francia taking home Michael Irvin. Little Michael to a Michael, one of the best receivers of all time. Uh, let me see what's wrong with this. This might be a cert issue here. I don't see any issues with the mini itself unless... I don't know. I just got my contacts in, Steven, so who knows? Uh, we've got Michael Irvin. No third card. There you go. So good condition. Uh, other than defects, some of these items in the black and blue, there's no cert. So if you want to trade this, if the person's okay with no cert, otherwise it's a good item to keep, especially for 20 bucks. Nicely done, Michael Francia on the Michael Irvin. Nothing wrong with this thing. It's very clean. One of the best receivers uh, for Miami and the Cowboys as well. Talk about programs that are historically amazing. Haven't been as amazing in recent years, although the Cowboys do sort of appear on the way back, Stephen, but we do get some inconclusive evidence on that front. Uh, as you say, let's see till the playoffs happen, right? Exactly. So... Congratulations, Michael Francia. Not bad. I'll give you $40, Michael, says Chris Roberts. Uh, I have not seen the Canes recruiting class, uh, but I don't know. I don't know if it's good because the quarterback was all hyped up, Don Beluso, and it hasn't worked out. So I, I try not to read too much in the recruiting classes. Texas A&M had a great recruiting class, and they were terrible. So it's not always hit and miss. Unless it's Alabama and Georgia, uh, Ohio State, I'm skeptical, Stephen. Those are the ones that I know will always get the best guys. Uh, number three says Dom. We'll see. We'll see. I think A&M was won this last year. So uh, I will reserve judgment until I see what happens. Uh, that's my, my gut feeling on that front. So let me know, guys, the extra point number one. Uh, they got a guy named the Pancake Honcho. Well, that's, I already like him at least. Mm. That much I can say. Great name. Uh, so we have a lot of breaks coming up, right? Black yep. and blue, seven and eight. We have the extra points. So I'm going to start randomizing here for our box numbers. Six, 10, 18, 20, and 24. I have not heard on a box number, so I will randomize here. We do have a black and blue seven, though. That's 12 from Colin, I believe. Okay, and then the number eight is the double. Number eight's the double. Perfect. I'll need two numbers for that one. Speaking of eight, eight clicks here for our box number. Now I'm saying if you have a number one class, you don't see benefits until year two or three. That's often the case. Uh, but lately, we do see more benefits early on. Uh, Twelve, says Matt. I'll we don't have 12, Matt. We have 6, 10, 18, or 24. Uh, so let me know if you would like one of those. Uh, Matt, I don't think Matt's in that. Oh, he's not in this break. An extra point? No. Okay. Mel wants 24. Okay, Mel, 24 works. 24 going off the ticker. We'll get you guys randomized eight times here for your divisions. I think Matt wants 12 for the next one, which is already what we're going to do because Colin's in there as well. Perfect. Uh, yep, 12, 12 in the next black and blue works well, Matt. Uh, we can do that for sure. Eight clicks. Let's go. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right, Adam Campbell up top of the NFC North. How about a little Adrian Peterson? Jerry's got the NFC South. It's Dustin in the NFC East. Steve, NFC West. 
Uh, we have Brogan in the AFC North, Melvin AFC South. We have Michael Frank AFC East and Peter Malecki. So Melvin Boone, he makes me think of my first TV station I worked at, Stephen. We had a director whose name was Melvin. He made the best chili ever. Mm. And he made it for the Christmas season uh, just heavenly. So good vibes to that chili, which seems incredible today because it's a cold in Chicago now. It Stephen. is very cold. Only going to get cold this weekend, too. Here we go. 24 of 35 extra point ref helmets. Uh, we have 11 boxes left. We have four headliners left. So that's pretty crazy. What do we have in here? Well, well, well. The odds at a headliner just got better. However, I would say this is a great hit. This guy in some series is a headliner. Uh, he's got a bunch of seasons over 1,000 receiving yards, including this year. I would say top 10 receiver in the league. Scary Terry. Terry McLaurin on the Washington mm. football flash helmet. Nice. Uh, so very cool. That's Dustin Danes, double D, taking home the dub with the Scary Terry McLaurin. Uh, it is arguably better than Kevin's famous chili from the office because Melvin doesn't drop it like Kevin. Mm. That's one of my favorite scenes in TV history. It's just classic. Absolutely classic. Uh, so Vinny, Vinny's got good taste, man. This guy, Vinny, uh, has excellent taste for sure. Dustin taking home Terry McLaurin. And if that's not a headliner, uh, it means it's a good series, Extra Point. True, true, true. Very good series. Congrats on the scary Terry. All righty. We've got black and blue seven. Next, we'll do 12. Then we have black and blue eight. That's a double box break. So if you're in black and blue eight, you've got a box number, uh, let me know. Black and blue nine is up as well. We got one spot to go in the next authentic, five to go in the footballs. Uh, so we are moving. Seven to go in loaded dice. So cool. Having a good time here in the break room, knocking out a lot of good stuff. We got box. 12 box 12 yes sir 40 box series steven will not be around very long the brady box bobby shaw wants 10 i'm guessing he's in black and blue eight yep that's one i need to uh yes sir there you go finney will work on getting some more boxes and loaded dice when we get caught up here sir that break is not moving right now, though. So we'll get you some more numbers if we get close on filling up that break. Uh, black and blue, 12 out of 40 here. We will go eight clicks here for our divisions. Good luck, folks. Uh, let's see some heat. Let's see some heat in the black and blue. You've seen, what, two headliners so far? A lot more goodies still out there, though. We have Colin Pelletier. What's up? In what? The black and blue? The black and blue. What? Oh, my God. Uh, we have Colin Pelletier in the NFC North. Dave Bechtel, NFC South. It's Melvin, NFC East. Michael, NFC West. Chris, AFC North. Michael's got the AFC South. Chris Roberts is in here. Look at that, Steven. You didn't even tell me. I'm shocked right now. I did not. He I'm shook. Him. I'm shook. I was waiting for you to see your surprise reaction. I know. And then Colin Pelletier, I was like, I didn't do a double take. Is that Chris? Chris Roberts? The Chris Roberts. The Chris Roberts is in this break. All right. Legend. The Christmas Kringle himself. <laughs> That's him. That's him. He's a good guy. He is a good guy. Very good guy. Uh, we'll show you guys just how good here uh, in a little bit. So 12 out of 40. Let's see what we got here. The Brady box, right? Sir. We've got ourselves. I think it's a jersey here. I believe we got a jersey here. Ooh, I like this one. Uh, we've got a William Perry, the fridge, Clemson jersey. Oh. Super Bowl champion with the 85 Bears. Before that, man was a beast at Clemson. Uh, let's see what's wrong with this jersey here. Number 66 instead of 72. Uh, in his college days, 
guessing there's no cert card because it looks pretty good to me and other than the jsa tag uh but i'm not seeing any other issue with this one personally uh let's see let's see william perry no certification card i'll show you guys right here what i'm looking at william perry no cert card otherwise uh perfect condition for the clemson perry jersey so that's an nfc north hit he was a bears legend that's colin pelletier congrats colin on one of the best nicknames in sports bridge very clean very very clean cameron will trade the hubbard jersey for it good luck cameron i'm sure that's michael francia's cameron frank by the mm -hmm. way i doubt colin's accepting that trade but if you want it colin could be a trade option for sure uh, did we ever come up with a good trade, Colin, for the Panthers helmet I got yesterday with the double signatures? The gift that keeps on giving, says Chris Roberts. No kidding. Uh, that's up to you guys. I have not heard uh, on a trade offer from you guys. If you guys have something, uh, you can make it happen. So, Colin Pelletier back in the winning circle. Uh, so, let's keep it rolling here in this black and blue. What's rolling? I mean, we might sell it out this show, Stephen. Uh, I'm serious. I mean, you talked about that. Uh, there's gonna be a day where we don't have our dinner break. Oh God! I feel like this series has that potential. It has that potential. Although with it being a double box break, with how quickly it's selling, we'll see. I might, I might as well get moving here on the breaks. Then might as well get moving when we keep going. Know what you're looking for, says Raymond. Very cool jersey, says Colin. Doubt that he's going to sell that. Uh, we have a black and blue double. Number eight is next. Then we have a black and blue double. Number nine as well, right? But in between that, we got a hurt so good authentic number two that I'm making for you. So. Okay, perfect. So good. The authentic is moving too. Brand new series. Want me to order you guys some pizza, says Vinny? And I'm not going to tell you no. I'm not going to say no, Vinny. <laughs> We had a guy who said that one time, though. Pizza never came in. Yeah. So, we'll see. Just so you know, I like any pizza. I know people are very particular about their pizza, Stephen. I say any pizza's good with me. I mean, you can't completely you, biff it, but yeah, usually I'm okay with pretty much it. Uh, you put anything on it, I'll eat it. I don't usually eat anchovies, I but... Say, I don't eat anchovies or, like, olives. I don't need olives. But, but any of those other things? Yes. Uh, we have box 10 I saw for black and blue. That's one of them. Uh, we need one more. Bacon sausage pepperoni. Bacon sausage, so, perfect. That sounds good. I'm definitely more of a pepperoni than a sausage guy, personally. Uh, but it's all good. Nothing in particular, says Raymond. Just looking for a fair trade. There you go. Hey, man. 33-13 Eastern Michigan. Pour it on on San Jose State. Let's go! Eastern Michigan, baby! Uh, about time I have a breathing bet today. Uh, fantastic. Bobby Shaw wants three. Okay, Bobby. We'll do three and ten here. Uh, and the can't miss. Or not the can't miss, excuse me. The black and blue. Uh, so Bobby's got both box calls. Three and ten. Looking to bring him some luck. He got two, which is just still hanging out there, Steven. Yeah. Hanging out there. So black and blue eight, then we'll do the Hurts So Good Authentics, then we'll do black and blue nine double box break. Uh, Colin's asking if Bobby's on Discord. Uh, when you get a second, Steven, I think I'm logged in. But if you have the link by chance. Yeah, give me a second. Yeah, you're good. No rush. Logged in here. This might not be me, but. No, it's me. You can do. You can use that though. Okay, let me get this break up yeah. here, and we'll send you that Discord. But Bobby Shaw, uh, it is ultimate autographs on Discord, sir. Randomizer going up. We'll go eight clicks here. Good luck, everybody. Let's see what we got in the black and blue double. Seven and eight. Ethan up top in the eight, NFC North. We have a Barry Sanders in this series. Bob Boulay's got the NFC South. It's Adam in the NFC East. He's a Cowboy fan. Matthew, NFC West. Ethan's got the AFC North. Matthew, AFC South. Uh, Robert, AFC East. And Dave, AFC West. All right. Black and blue double coming up. We have 10. We have three. I'll do three first in the double box break. Good luck, folks. Let's see some heat here. 
moving and grooving in the series. Only 458. <laughs> so. I don't think we've had a break. I would say, though, break. if we've knocked off about 12, 14 of these, we can knock out the rest of these by six. Now that it's a double box break, possible. Possible. Uh, Matthew Ludwig, we call him the silent assassin here in the break room. He only comes in for box numbers. Uh, he is getting himself a fantastic quarterback, Matt Hasselbeck, flash mini helmet for the Seattle Seahawks. Beautiful. We want the ball and we're going to score, but you know what? Uh, the man who was a very good quarterback made the Super Bowl. Uh, so rock solid player, Matt Hasselbeck. Let me look at the listing. What is wrong with the Hasselbeck? You talk too much trash. Talk too much trash. I like that, Steven. But you got to be confident. You got to be confident. For some reason, I'm not seeing that on there. Uh, so. Let me take a look. Let me show it. I mean, it's Hasselback. Maybe a smudge on the. Looks in pretty good condition. It is a Beckett search, so there's got to be something wrong with it. I don't know. I don't know, Steven. Uh, I, I think it looks pretty good. I might be missing something. Nonetheless, though, congratulations. Scratch and slash Ludwig. discoloration. Okay. There's two of them. Two of series. them. But he's not the only one. Oh, right here. Discoloration. Okay, I can see it here. Just a little bit. A little bit like a green spot right there. So, congrats, Matthew, on the Matt Hasselback. It's a mat to a mat. Uh, nicely done. Okay. Some of these items are not that damaged, Steven. Now, some will be more damaged, but some of them are in decent shape, I'd mm -hmm. say. Man, hassle back. And what is the backup of this series? I guess it's the slabs, right? Yep. Okay, so we'll be ready to go. For... I mean, I'm thinking the slabs are going to be the backup for the footballs, but this might close out first. Might close out first. The way it's going. Crazy. Uh, all right, let me get to this next box. I know we have a double box break. Footballs, uh, we, we have five spots to go in. Five spots to go, and how many footballs? Are four left, four right? Left, yeah. To close out a few series today. The minis, we got three minis left. Jerseys, we got three jerseys left. Let's keep it rolling. Here we go, black and blue. What do we have in here? Ooh, this. You know what, Steven? If I remember correctly, this is one of these guys who's on a new team, and there's going to be no issues with this one. We've got ourselves one of the best running backs in the league, maybe the best dual threat running back, Christian McCaffrey Ooh. on the Flash Mini Helmet. I think Dang. it's in perfect condition. Beckett certified, perfect condition. He's simply on a new football team. Bob Poulet taking home that Mini Helmet for 40 bucks in the double box break. One of three guys with 1,000 rushing yards, 1,000 receiving yards in the same season. Roger Craig, Marshall Falk, Christian McCaffrey. Congratulations, Bob Boulay. That is clean. Uh, given that he got this for 40 bucks, Stephen. Love that flash, man. Uh, this is the hit of the show so far. Yeah. Uh, biggest name, beautiful looking mini helmet, uh, Christian McCaffrey. So, new team. That's the only issue with it. Congrats. Bobby B. That's cool. That is very cool, man. Love that. And I'll put that next to you, Steven, because even though that's a full-size authentic, this is one of the best running backs in the league. It's got to be hit of the show so far, at so least. So far. Although we pulled that Tyree Kill authentic, uh, forget about it. Even the Barry Sanders, even with the scratch, I would feel okay putting Barry Sanders uh, as the hit of the show. So here's Mr. McCaffrey, C-Mac. Uh, nicely done. Double box break. Uh, we have the Hurt So Good Authentics next. Wade's in here. Jordan, Michael, Raymond, and then Robert. Let me know on a box number. Then we will rock and roll here uh, in the Authentics. So refreshing the break page. Let's take a peek here. We are four away on live break 10 in the black and blue. Uh, so... We're moving. So we just did boxes 3 and 10. We have 2, 11, 12, 14, and 15 left. 
I'm going to get the authentic boxes randomized. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So what do we do in the last one? I must have forgotten to take it off. Seven. Seven. Okay, so seven going off. Then Robert wants six. So I'll get six and seven uh, both off the ticker here. And the Hurts So Good Authentics, named after the one, the only, Jalen Hurts. All righty. Rolling right now, Steven. Absolutely mm -hmm. rolling in the break room. Break after break after break. Uh, we had a little bit of a slower Sunday compared to what we've done. A little bit of a slower Monday early show. Uh, but last night and today, we're back to doing what we do best. Just ripping through breaks left and right. Uh, Raymond Lowe up top in the NFC North. Uh, we've got Wade in the NFC South. Michael, you've got the NFC East. Uh, then we have Robert in the NFC West. Uh, we have Jordan, AFC North. Wade, AFC South. Raymond, AFC East. And Wade in the AFC West. Hurts so good, Authentics. Uh, let's see some more heat in this series, guys. Looking forward to plenty of fire. Merry Christmas, says Vinny. Pizza will be there in 55 to 60 minutes. Are you serious? Uh, that's a great question. That's a great question. I hope we got the right address. Yeah. Uh, I guess, do we have to pick it up? Are they going to come in here? We're going to see how they approach it. All right, let's go. 55 to 60 minutes. I love Vinny. He's awesome. Here we go. Box six out of 35 in the Authentics. What could we have in here? Vinny's prepping us here. We have Michael Foster with the hit. Uh, the Cowboys security blanket for Troy Aikman. A five-time Pro Bowl tight end. Uh, one of the best tight ends in the 90s. Three-time Super Bowl champ. He put it there on the helmet. Jay Novacek, flash authentic. Congratulations, Michael Foster. All right, Mike. He's won several things this show, I believe, Steven. Yes, he has. Not his first win. Not his first rodeo. Uh, nicely done, Michael. Okay. Uh, Jay Novacek was a very uh, unappreciated guy on that Cowboys team in the 90s. I know we had Emmett Smith. Or Aikman, Michael Irvin got all the credit, uh, but he made five Pro Bowls, Stephen, 91 to 95, five Pro Bowls in a row for Mr. Novacek. Is it sweet 134, Stephen? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. The 770 Brush Hill Road? Probably shouldn't say our address yeah. on the screen. We'll uh, see. We'll see. If anything, we'll see. We'll just be, thank you, Vinny. Yeah, thank you, Vinny. Appreciate that, man. You the man. Where did he get his pizza from? I don't know. Great question. I guess we we'll have to find out. I mean, it might, it might help to know just so we know. Just wonder who that guy's going to call. going to call Ghostbusters. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, black and blue number nine, double box break. We have Michael, Chris, Michael, Christopher Vendura, Robert Alvarado, Rob Larson, Vincent Patani, and Michael Foster. Let me know. Two box numbers needed. In black and blue number nine. Series is flying off the rails. Yes, Edward will knock out more box, put more boxes up there below the dice. Uh, I'll give you guys, I'll tell you what, you guys knock off four, three spots. We get the four spots left. I'll give you guys uh, more boxes. I'll give you like four or five more boxes and loaded dice. Mm -hmm. Oh. 11 and 15. 11 and 15. So perfect. Randomizer going up. Eight clicks here. We'll take 11 and 15 off in the black and blue. You know what, Steven? I'll give these guys. We'll start with box nine for now. And then I will add in. Uh, I'll add in through 12. 10, 11, and 12 once we get the four spots away. You guys help me out. I'll give you guys some more boxes in the dice. I guess you could bring in more for black and blue, though, right? Yeah, that's, what that's what you're thinking. Fredo's or pizza by Alfredo. It's like Kevin from The Office. I like it. I don't know. I think it's Alfredo's is better than pizza by Alfredo. Uh, so you can find a lot of stuff on Google. That's for sure. Yeah, we'll do 10, 11, and 12 on loaded dice. 
uh, on the ticker once we knock off a few more. But only a 15 crate series, Steven. So crazy. Five, six, seven, and eight. We've got Robert Alvarado up top in the NFC North. It's Christopher Ventura below him in the NFC South. Vinny's got the NFC East. Michael Frank, NFC West. Chris Leonard, AFC North. Rob Larson, AFC South. Michael Francia, AFC East. Michael Foster, AFC West. Here we go. 11 out of 40 in the black and blue. What could we have in here? Another mini helmet. Another mini helmet. Got ourselves one of the best linebackers of all time. It is Jack Ham. Steeler Legend Hall of Fame 88. That is Beckett certified on the Jack Ham mini helmet. Uh, we have just a small smudge on the top of the helmet. Small smudge. You can barely see it on the stream, but a very small smudge on the Jack Ham uh, flash mini helmet. Congratulations, Chris Leonard. Uh, on the ham mini. Okay, Chris. Nicely done, dude. Very nice. We have one more in the double. We'll do box 15 next. What a great time here in the break room. We're having a great time knocking out a lot of heat. Ah, those boxes, man. Steven, we're... We're almost halfway through with the series already. Yes, sir. Uh, just over an hour in the program. Guess what, Steven? Got a heavy box here. Ooh. Got a heavy box here. Who came out of the first well. box? Who came out of the first uh, box? The first box was um, Jack Ham. Ooh, Jack very Ham. Nice. Underrated player. Underrated player, no doubt. All right. 15 out of 40 here in the black and blue. Let's see what we got here. Let's see some heat. Should be a full-size rep, I'm guessing, Steven. Should be a full-size rep. It is, in fact, a full-size rep. One of the best receivers in the 1990s. Uh, we have ourselves Andre Risen on the Packers Lunar. Super Bowl champion inscription. Uh, fantastic player, played with the Falcons, the Packers as well, among many teams. Bad Moon Rising, we see on the helmets a lot. Andre Risen, rock solid hit. NFC North, Robert Alvarado. Uh, Five-time Pro Bowler, by the way. Co-led the league in uh, receiving touchdowns in 1993. First-team All-Pro in 1990. More than 10,000 career receiving yards. Andre Risen. So nicely done. Let's see what's wrong with this bad boy, Steven. Uh, I, I mean, think... I my own opinion. But... <laughs> right. Uh, helmet, right? Uh, there's a small smudge on top of the helmet. A little box cutter issue here. Uh, you can barely see it on the stream, uh, but pretty good condition on the Andre Ryzen. Very cool. Is it on the auto side? Uh, not on the auto side. It's mm -hmm. on like... What well, is technically it's above the auto. Oh, okay. It's like right here. Let me see if you can see it. It is kind of on the auto side, but it doesn't really show up on the stream. Mm, okay. So nicely done. Uh, Adam saying 12 should be off the ticker. Hey, okay, Adam, 12 going off. That works, my friend. You bring in what, 15 through 20 or like yeah, three more? I, I, I brought in three more, but I put it 15 through 20. So if they want one, I Okay, it. we I can go in the back it. for yeah. those few. So, so it's literally closed out. Okay. So, Raymond, I do want to be up front with you. Uh, we do not... So, we have a shipping guy, right? Luke does shipping. He organizes the boxes for shipping. Uh, I know that technically we're going to ship on uh, Thursday. However, he's got his own system, and some of those boxes have already been organized and prepared to be sent out. Uh, so, we only facilitate trades once uh, if it's the same show. We flip the stickers. It gets... It gets super messy uh, if it's not during the same show. So, unfortunately, Raymond, uh, it is break room policy. I can't just ship that uh, straight to uh, Colin. Uh, we can't do that. Yeah, just because we can't do it, that. And we, we only do it if it's the same show and we can flip the stickers. Because, mm -hmm. I mean, that shipment, I know we ship out on Thursday, Stephen. 
Uh, but our shipping guy may have already boxed it up. You might already have boxes together of everything you've won. Yep. And then to unbox it, it just gets very messy. Uh, and obviously, if that gets lost in the mail, then it gets very complicated. It's very bad. So. We're, we're in trouble for it. So, unfortunately... It's coming to you right now. It's coming to you. And you guys can work it out amongst yourselves. Uh, technically, Steven, I'm not even supposed to flip the stickers. I know that's mm -hmm. frowned upon... Uh, by our shipping and customer service team. I make that exception for you guys, but I can only go as far as flipping yeah. the stickers in the same show. So unless it's out of the same show, uh, everything for trades is uh, for you guys to get done. We don't get involved there. Sorry about that, man. I wish I could do something for you, but that's just the official rules of Ultimate Autographs. I know we say they ship Thursday, but every once in a while... They could get shipped out early, too. That's kind of our official policy. We say Monday and Thursday on the shipping. Because, right, I can tell you now when I came in here, Luke's already organized a bunch of things. Yep. So your helmet might already be ready to send. Uh, we just haven't maybe sent it out just yet. Uh, Raymond saying no worries. We'll get it worked out. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Always good to ask. It never hurts to ask any questions. Uh, Chris Leonard, Colin Pelletier, Sean Kowalski, Michael Francia, Matthew Ludwig, and Michael Foster. Let me know uh, two numbers for the black and blue double box break. Otherwise, Steven, what are we close on? We're pretty, we're actually pretty open at the moment. I know the next black and blue is probably going to fill up pretty quickly. Pretty quickly yeah. So I would, I would have guessed. So. That's this, a, this one took a little longer than usual, but. Yeah. Well, as we get further and further, I mean, what's. What's the one people want in here? The Tyree Kill Authentic, right? Barry Sanders. Barry Sanders. Uh, oh, that's a... Is that a rep or is that authentic, Barry Sanders? Devontae I think Adams? A, I think it's a rep, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff in there. Uh, I, think, so, I think it's just the bang for your buck value with that, you know? No kidding. You can just win such good stuff. I know it's maybe a little... Like, that Devontae Adams has a visor on it. And that's, that's a flash replica helmet with no issues. Mm -hmm. No issues on that one. So, okay, I'll get the randomizer prepped. And actually, you have what in the room? 2, 14, 15, 16, 17? 2, 14, 16, 17, 18. We did 15 already? Yes. Okay, so I'm just going to randomize the ones that you have here in the room. I do have 19 and 20 already on the ticker, though. If you want to call them out for the next break. Okay. So, randomizer going up. Well, let's go, folks. Let's see what boxes we're doing here. Black and blue. Carefree. Gonzo. Michael Irvin. Gone. Gone. Tyree Kill. One gone. Of the, gone. One of the two. Yeah, the yeah, football. The okay, Steven, we'll do 18 and 2. So the Peyton Manning box and the one we were just having out there. The Drew Lock box. The Drew Lock box. You know what? Uh, and then number two? Box is not on the desk yet. We'll do 16 and 19 instead. Uh, so, Colin wants 16 and 19. Drew Locke is number two. But I, I have to hesitate there for a second because uh, Drew Locke was number three in college. And he's number two. He was actually three on the Seahawks. Or on the Broncos, oh, Broncos. too. Uh, he's two now on the Seahawks. I always think of him as three. So, I was yeah. like, wait. But I see what you're saying. Uh, so, randomizer going up. Eight clicks. Here we go, guys. Good luck for your divisions here. Black and blue. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. We've got Michael Francia up top in the NFC North. Matthew Ludwig's got the NFC South. Matthew in the NFC East. It's Sean NFC West. We got Michael AFC North. Colin AFC South. Chris Leonard AFC East. And Colin AFC West. 16 out of 40. Then we'll do 19 next here in the black and blue. The Joe Montana box, Stephen. It's another mini helmet. Let's see who we got here. Brian Edwards. He was the Ooh. star at South Carolina. Uh, played for the Raiders. I think he's just on a new team right now. Brian Edwards. Uh, JSA certified. Uh, that is the AFC West. Alan Pelletier calling out the box number and taking home the Brian Edwards. Matt Ryan, my goodness, poor guy. 
He blew the largest Super Bowl lead, and he blew the largest halftime lead. I know he didn't do it. His team did it. But obviously, not something that looks good on a cover letter for the Hall of Fame, at least, right? It does not. It does not look good. Uh, Brian Edwards actually is a practice squad member of the Chiefs. I think he's been on the Falcons at one point this season as well. Uh, former Raider. Uh, has uh, four receiving touchdowns in his NFL career. His best days were with the Raiders. Colin taking home the Brian Edwards. Yeah, nothing wrong with it. Simply just on a new squad. All righty. We'll see what we got in the next one. Colin and everyone else. Brian Edwards. You know what, Steven? What's that? I'm looking forward to seeing something cool here. This is going to be a pretty heavy box here. So this could be the Tyreek Hill Authentic. Let's see. And this might be authentic. I'm not always the best at reading these. I think it's an authentic and not a rep. I mean, regardless of who it is, you get an authentic uh, in this series, even for 40 bucks. Even if you buy out all the spots, it might it. be worth it. Box 19 out of 40, black and blue. Feeling heavy. Feeling like an authentic, potentially. Come on out. Hard to rip this one. It's a big one, Steven. It's a big one. Oh, oh my goodness. We got ourselves the hit of the show. Colin Pelletier, AFC West. He spent 80 bucks in this break. Already got one helmet. He gets a second one. Tyreek oh. Hill Eclipse Authentic the Cheetah. There it goes. Look at that. 40 bucks for that spot. AFC West. Six seasons in Kansas City, Stephen. Six Pro Bowls. First season in Miami. Already second in the league in receiving yards. That is PSA certified. That is how you do a double box break. That is how you do a black and blue Tyreek Hill. That is incredible. Nothing oh. wrong with this bad boy. I could argue, Steven, this is the hit of the series coming out in box 19. You never know when the good ones come out. Uh, that is rock solid. I know Barry Sanders is the biggest name, uh, but this one has no issues with it. Uh, Colin Pelletier on the Cheetah. Holy moly. I love the Eclipse as well for the Chiefs. We actually have pulled a lot of uh, flashes, Lunars, standard helmets for the Chiefs lately. I haven't seen the Chiefs Eclipse in a hot minute, and it is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Thing of beauty, Colin, uh, with the Cheetah. Yes, that is awesome. Sweet, says Colin. Vinny saying nice call, Colin. Did you call uh, them both? He did call them both. Uh, we have P375 Bear saying nice. It is very nice. Mr. Pelletier. That's the hit of the show. Steven, it's going next to you. Uh, going to be tough to top it. It's going to be tough. Going to be tough to top it. Uh, it's it, it might be the best kid in that series, although Barry Sanders is an Eclipse replica helmet. Devontae Adams with the visor. I think that one's a replica, but also very cool and a flash. We got Michael Francia saying, awesome, awesome indeed, man. Uh, that is absolutely beautiful. Uh, won that for 40 bucks in there with that spot. I only had 80 in the break, but that spot alone uh, paid off. So one spot to go in the next black and blue double. That's break 11. We have one spot in the football that's coming up. Otherwise, we're pretty open on the break page. Uh, that seems to be what you guys are after today. I'll give these guys the more loaded dice boxes, though, Stephen. We'll do 1, 6, 9, 10, 11, and 12. They're asking for more boxes. Uh, we'll give you guys all those boxes in the dice. So who's going to close up the next black and blue? Who's going to close up the footballs? Who wants to see some heat? Fantastic show uh, today. Already done a whole bunch of boxes. I mean, I can tell you we did two black and blues yesterday. So if the ticker's correct, we've done 13 Am I bad at math here? Five, 14, I think, in this series already. 14 boxes. Yes. We did an extra point. That's 15. 13, because we did 7 plus 6. Okay, 13 boxes in 
black and blue that actually makes sense because we have five on the ticker than two yesterday it's gonna be it's gonna be five, 15 F 15 after this double fills up so 15 down in that series we've done one rep break we've done a jersey break two authentics and we're about to do a football so we're over 20 boxes football and a black and blue yeah. which one do i do first uh let's do what filled up first the black and blue let's do the black and blue first then we'll do the football so already more than 20 boxes down. Uh, we're at the one hour and 23 minute mark of the happy hour show. That is fantastic. You guys are awesome. Best people in the business. Got the best customers in the game. Easily. Uh, just easily. Love it. Love it. I mean, we just dropped the series. Like, I mean, this was late last night, Stephen. It was like, we're on until 11.35 last night. We dropped this at like 11... Maybe 11.05. We did two of these last night. Oof. So it's been up for very little time. Very little time, but it is a red hot break. So black and blue 11s ready to go. Michael Frank, Michael Francia, Chris Leonard, Rob Larson, Peter Malecki, Steve Durkey, Dave Harris, and Michael Foster. Uh, give me two box numbers, guys. Uh, how do you win, says Austin. Austin, here is the live break page link. This is how you enter. You have a one in eight chance to win with each spot you get. You get randomized into uh, eight NFL divisions. If a player comes out uh, from one of those divisions, you win. So let's just say Barry Sanders comes out. You have to have the NFC North. You win. Yeah. You got the NFC North. You win with the Vikings, Bears, Packers, or Lions. If one of those four teams comes out, you got fourteen and eighteen. Okay, fourteen getting off the ticker, and eighteen as well. All righty, black and blue, and fuego. I don't think we're going to sell it out this show, Stephen, but during tonight's show, I think it's going to be gone. Yeah. Uh, if we can do like 15, maybe more of this series in an early show, we'll get the rest of the 20 so done tonight. Four, five, 14 and 18. Peyton Manning box. Uh, we have NFC North is Michael Foster. We got Chris Leonard in the NFC South. Peter Malecki's got the NFC East. Is Michael Frank in the NFC West. Rob Larson, AFC North. Michael Francia, AFC South. Steve's got the AFC East. Steve Durkee and Dave Harris in the AFC West. So, a lot of goodies. And I have another excellent break here. Start with 14 first. We'll do 18 next in the black and blue. All righty. What could we have in here? You never know what you're going to get in this series. You really don't. It's one of those that you're paying 20 bucks. You may not get something great, but then you could also get a Tyree Kill, a Christian McCaffrey, a Barry Sanders, uh, Devontae Adams. You just never know. You can also get one of the best offensive linemen of all time. We have Rob Larson, AFC North, taking home Jonathan Ogden on the Flash Mini Helmet. Uh, one of the best flashes out there. Hall of Fame 13 inscription. Jonathan Ogden, Beckett certified. That is beautiful. Let me take a peek here. What is supposedly wrong with the Jonathan Ogden? Because it looks in pretty good shape for me. Let's see here. Jonathan Ogden. We've got... Damage near the ear hole. Oh, I see it right here. The ear hole is just a little, it's like a paint chip. You really almost, yeah, you could see it a little bit on camera, but it's very minor. Just a little light damage near the ear hole. Congratulations, Rob Larson, uh, on the Flash Mini Helmet, Jonathan Ogden. Hey, Rob. Not bad, sir. Not bad at all. So let me know, guys, what you're looking to rock and roll with uh, next. I'm sure it's going to be this series as well. Uh, do we have a football break ready to go, though? So if you got a box number in the football break, uh, I will take it. Eastern Michigan up 41-20 to 20 in the fourth quarter, Steven. Pour it on, baby. Give me that money. Uh, we have 18 next. I got the heat minus three against my bowl. Lots of locker room drama going on. In the Bulls camp? Yep, yep. Wrong. 
Uh, apparently me... at halftime, because you saw that we gave up 150 to the T-Wolves the other day, right? Yeah, that was not good. At halftime, there was, there's been some expressing of frustration towards our $215 million man. That Zach Levine? Mm-hmm. Uh, Zach Levine needs to stop running his mouth. That's yeah. all I got to say. <laughs> man needs to stop. Uh, Austin, here is the site. Live break page link. Here's where you get your spots. I'm saying teammates were expressing frustration to him. Okay. Well, I watched the Bulls game earlier this year against the Bucks, where they played amazing defense. And I was like, I've never seen them play this type of defense. Why can't they do it more often? Because I, Zach Levine's not that kind of person, in my opinion. I don't know. Uh, Can we, he score and it look beautiful? Yeah, but does he play defense two ways? Like, well, it's not just what? it's not just him though. 155. That's the whole squad. I know, but yeah. I'm saying, but I'm, but, but that's not. But it all game. starts with your leader. Yeah, that's true. Look at Michael Jordan. He played defense. He played and defense. you could talk about LeBron and Jordan. Look at all the all defensive teams Jordan has. Yeah. Above ten, only player to ever lead the league in scoring and win defensive player of the year. It's impressive. Exactly. Very impressive. <laughs> you know what else is impressive? The difference. Uh, this jersey right here. We've got Ooh. a guy who is a pro football Hall of Famer, a college football Hall of Famer. NFL MVP, Heisman yeah. Trophy, PSA certified, one of the best running backs of all time, Earl Campbell. Ooh, like okay. Uh, sick looking light blue jersey, almost like Argentina colors. Vamos Argentina, celebrating the World Cup today in front of 4 million people like in Buenos Aires. It was a party. So, Earl Campbell. Uh, let's see what's wrong with this. Let's see what the listing says. It's in pretty good shape, Stephen. Uh, pretty good shape. I always like looking. Uh, let's see. Certification sticker issue. So I think it's the uh, the sticker up top here is partly come off. But you do have this other sticker as well. So Earl Campbell, that's the AFC South. And that is Michael Francia. This guy is cleaning out this series. Yes, Steven. he is. He's won multiple things in the black and blue. Michael, Michael, Michael. How we do. That's how we do, sir. Uh, beautiful. Miami Heat have also been off this year, too, Stephen. I'm tempted to bet with you there. We'll see how I feel. I trust the Heat more than uh, I trust the Bulls. That's fair. Even though uh, you are correct, they have been. They've been off this year. Off. But we all know what the real, what the real drama is. Oh, no. I'm sorry, Bob. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, Stephen, what was the results? Let's see. Black and blue, eight. Think you won, Bob? Isn't... Bob, you won the Christian McCaffrey mini. You got a Christian McCaffrey flash mini, Bob. Yes, sir, I that was a headliner hit, and there was nothing wrong with it. He's simply on a new team. There's simply a and that, niner. That's the second best hit of the show, Bob, behind the Tyree Kill with mm -hmm. Clips Authentic. So you did win, Bob. Apologize. I'm sorry on the funeral. Uh, send my thoughts and prayers, but otherwise, congratulations, man, on the McCaffrey mini. Mr. Bob Boulay. NFC South. The snipe that bad boy. How Bob does? How he does? He's a sniper. So that was Michael Francia. You won the Earl Campbell. Great thing, says Bob. You are that baby. very welcome. Very clean. Do you have it, Stephen? I think you put that one away. But... I do, but I can get it in a second. Okay. We'll show it to you, Bob, in a second. I mean, I guess Hill is the hit of the show, but we can have that as sort of like a silver medal. McCaffrey. Congrats, Michael, on the Earl Campbell, which could be a bronze medal. That's a pretty cool jersey, man. Pretty cool jersey. Are you ready for some footballs? We got Adam Cantwell, Ryan Hicks, Ralph Fonaro, and Michael Frank. Should put some of those boxes up there, Kama. Uh Yes. Mm -hmm. Give me some of these boxes. Yep. You said? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Uh, Vinny, so photos take a little bit longer to ship. Uh, if you have any questions, email our customer service team. I know those are a little bit uh, different shipping schedule. So that may take a little longer. I know Vinny wants to get it to his boss, probably hoping for before Christmas. Uh, so send our customer service team an email and see what they can do for you, Vinny. Uh, our same guy who does shipping also does customer service. So Luke would be your best uh, content contact there. So I'm going to get the boxes randomized here in the footballs. 36, 39, 42, and 43. Only four footballs left, Steven. Mm -hmm. Cool. That series will be 
We might close out like three or four series tonight. We might. Oh, uh, we definitely might. Ralph wants 36. Bob Boulay, that's your Christian McCaffrey. Ooh, that's sexy, Steven. That is absolutely beautiful on the McCaffrey Flash Mini Helmet, Bob Boulay. One of three guys with a thousand rushing yards and receiving yards in the same season. So we got a box call, actually, Steven. Cool. 36 in the footballs by Ralph. Ralph has a bunch of spots in here. Uh, looking for some heat. We do have one headliner left in the series. Uh, that is the Eric Dickerson football. So still the single season uh, rushing record holder. 2,105 yards rushing all the way back in 19, 1984. Impressive. Very impressive. Here we go. Eight clicks. Good luck, folks. Show me some good. Six, seven, and eight. We have Ralph up top in the NFC North. Uh, he is followed by Adam in the NFC South. We have Ralph, NFC East. Ralph, NFC West. Ralph also in the AFC North. Ryan's got the AFC South. It's Michael in the AFC East and Ralph in the AFC West. Taking a look at my screen here for the footballs. All righty. Who's ready? Who is ready? Where's the footballs? Let's go. 36 of 45. Such a fun series. Had a lot of fun. A lot of heat coming out. 22 bucks a spot. We got ourselves. Oh, baby, Steven. Uh, we have a fantastic hit here. The single season rushing record holder. Ninth all time in rushing yards. Eric Dickerson. Bam. Hall of Fame inscription on the football. Gold. The Duke Wilson football. That is very clean. That's the NFC West. And when you buy a bunch of spots in a break, Steven, what do you want to do? Up your odds. You want to up your odds, but you want to hit a headliner. If you do so, you profit. Ralph is profiting. Oh, NFC wow. West. Nicely done, Ralph, on the Eric Dickerson Gold Duke Wilson football. That right there is a rock solid hit. Absolutely fantastic. Congratulations, Ralph. Woo, baby. That is clean. The that is straight up fire. Black and blue 12. Boxes 17 and 20 says Chris. We'll do that, Chris. Let me write this up uh, for, Air, or for Ralph. And then we'll do 17 and 20 in the black and blue. Man, that series is just moving, Steven. Absolutely moving. All righty, Ralph what we got next year in the black and blue and i'll just take it give you the charlie joiner jersey too. that here's charlie joiner yeah. we'll do 17 first then we'll do 20 next down here. Good luck, folks. Eight clicks for our divisions. Black and blue, 12. Let me get 17 and 20 off the ticker. Steven, you can bring some more in, right? Yep. Thank you, Steven. I'll put 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25 up. We still have two out there, which we just completely skipped over. All right, eight clicks. Good luck, everybody. Let's see the heat here. Black and blue, already number 12, and a bunch of these have been double box breaks on top of it. Seven and eight clicks. Christopher Ventura up top in the NFC North. We've got Chris Leonard in the NFC South. There's Michael Francia in the NFC East. Robert Alvarado, NFC West. Nick Boyer, AFC North. Sean Kowalski, AFC South. Michael Frank, AFC East. And Nick, AFC West. Here we go 17 out of 40 black and blue we got 20 next as well what could we have in here folks in a series that's just moving right now we're moving we're grooving this is filling up like crazy here got ourselves a headliner coming up headliner coming up the juice is on the loose. OJ Simpson 
uh, Pro Football Hall of Famer, College Football Hall of Famer. Uh, he, of course, won the Heisman Trophy and the NFL MVP. There's a little small scuff on top of the bill there, but overall pretty good condition on the O.J. Simpson. That's the AFC East, and that is Michael Frank. Okay, Michael, I think he told us he's a Chiefs fan and a Bills fan, but he'll like the O.J. Simpson mini helmets. Okay, Mike, we see you, Michael Frank. Nicely done, sir. That's how we do it. Always like getting guys the squads that they like. Uh, O.J. Simpson. Ooh. Michael Frank, Stephen, is a Chief fan and a Bill fan. He is in, like, football heaven. Football heaven for Mr. Frank. He's got the OJ, which is perfect for him. Works out perfect. We double box break. Gotta love it. Got one more coming up. What do we have after the OJ? What is next? Might be another mini. Feels a little light. Here. Let's see what we got. Ooh, I like this one. I like this one. You know who else is going to like this one? Nick Boyer. We got ourselves. Chad Johnson, Mr. Ocho Cinco. You can kind of see the autograph is smudged right there. Pro Bowl receiver in the 2000s. One of the best to do it for the Bengals. Had him on my first fantasy team. Helped me win a fantasy title. Uh, Chad Johnson worked for World Cup tonight during the World Cup. Uh, he was a six-time Pro Bowler, three-time first-team All-Pro. Led the league in receiving yards in 2006. And this is the guy who, Steven, I am very proud of. Chad Ocho Cinco? Uh, he got converted during the World Cup. He went into the World Cup telling us that Cristiano Ronaldo was the GOAT. By the time the World Cup was done, he said Lionel Messi's the GOAT. Yeah, I respect the man that's so, willing to change his opinion. Sign of maturity, Nick Boyer taking home Chad Johnson. All right, Nick. Not bad. Not bad uh, at all. So double box break, knocked out in the black and blue. We are 19 down in this series, Stephen. 21 more to go because we have box two left. That's the only one that we haven't done out of the, the first 20. Mm -hmm. Thank you, says Nick Boyer. Thank you for playing, Nick. You are welcome on your Jad Johnson. All righty. Let me take a peek at the break page here. We've got... Five to go in the next one. Uh, so, Stephen, let's knock out this chase wheel spin for the jerseys. That's been pretty stagnant this show. And we'll revisit things. If we're hot, we can keep going. However, we are cooling off a little bit. And, Stephen, if we're hot, we'll, we'll skip the dinner break. But I am leaning towards taking the dinner break here. Uh, so, pizza's about 20 minutes out, says Vinny. And pizza's 20 minutes out, too. If that is true, then, yeah, we're taking a dinner break. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so we'll knock out the chase wheel spin uh, for the jersey. We will refuel and refire. Yeah, no kidding. I know Matt doesn't want us eating on the stream, so I don't want to get in trouble there either. I'll eat on the stream. I mean, if we have to, <laughs> we will. We'll wash our hands, though, for sure. They have the number from your Google page, okay? Hope so, that's... So far. <laughs> I don't know that's I going to. That. Is that going to a net? I don't know. Okay. I don't think so. Okay, well, we'll see. Uh, we will see here. So, not your nice jerseys. We'll be on the lookout. And we'll be on the lookout for that pizza. Let's see. I don't have it. Here we go. Not your nice jerseys. I'll take all the folks in the not your nice jerseys and randomize you guys for sure. We're asking what headliners are left in black and blue. Uh, Robert, Devontae Adams, Derek Henry, Barry Sanders, uh, and Brian Dawkins are the headliners left. 6.04 p.m. says Vinny. Noted. Noted. We might have to go outside, Stephen. I will. I can brave, that. brave the cold. I had chicken rice planned for dinner, but I can eat that when I get home. Yeah, I can, that can easily, yeah. easily be adjusted. Can be adjusted. I could just leave mine for tomorrow. Uh, Ethan Williams. Chase wheel spin, Ethan. Uh, we'll get the wheel pulled up for you. Oh, there you go. We got Giordano, Stephen. Oh! We got some good pizza. 
Deep dish Chicago style. Vinny coming Vinny. through. Vinny. Man, I thought we were going to get like Domino's or Pizza Hut. I mean, that's are, still nice. Which is still mm -hmm. nice. Little Caesars. We're getting fancy in here. Going out. Giordano's. Woo, that's good. Stuck myself. Oh, man. All right. Starting off from the 7 p.m. show. No kidding. Uh, so, Ethan, we'll start you on one. Unless you want to buzzer beat me a number, we'll give you about 30 seconds here. Uh, if you wanted to start on another number, like seven, maybe your favorite number. Otherwise, we'll start you on one for the Chase Wheel Spin. And then we'll have black and blue 13. We are not canceling squat, Vinny. We're keeping. We're keeping. That's actually not a terrible idea, Steven, hmm. for us to call them and maybe they have our number. I don't yeah, know. I don't even know what Giordano's or wherever he... G yeah. What is the Giordano's? Yeah. I don't even know which one he called. I'll keep it. We'll just, yeah, we'll, we'll keep an eye on it. Mm -mm. Uh, so we're going to spin this wheel. Ethan, I've not heard from you. Let's see what you're taking home, man. Ethan Williams. It's a big one, Steven. We've got 66 bucks. Ooh. Ethan Williams, $66 gift card is coming your way. That's not bad. Steven, when we say we have the nicest customers in the business, I'm not waiting it's true. Mind. Chris Roberts sent us gifts yesterday. True. Vinny Batani sending us pizza. It's a merry, merry Christmas. These guys are me. absolutely Happy amazing. Happy holidays. Ace wheel spin for Ethan. There you 66. Go. Uh, Black and Blue 13, Michael Frank, Michael Foster, Ryan Hicks, Vincent Batani, Chris Leonard, Robert Alvarado, Michael Frank, Nick Boyer. Double box break. You've got two, 21, two, two and then 21 through 25. So let me know which one of those works, folks. That is what we will rock and roll with here in the Black and Blue. Now, this is the hottest break in the room right now. It's just tearing off the walls. Tearing off the walls here. Eastern Michigan, Stephen, up 14 with six minutes to go, and in the on the goal line. So, good. gonna get a win today. Gonna get a win today. Robert wants two and 24. Okay, Robert, two's going off the ticker. 24 going off as well. The Willowbrook Road one. Okay. Okay. The noted two, Vinny. Two and 20. Two and 24. Derek Jeter and Ken Griffey Jr. Are officially eliminated. Isn't that crazy? Oh. That's crazy. The series is on fire here. It's a fantastic series. Eight clicks. Good luck, guys. Let's see some heat. Six, seven, and eight. Michael Frank up top in the NFC North. We have Ryan Hicks in the NFC South. It's Michael Francia, NFC East. Nick, NFC West. Vinny, AFC North. Michael AFC South, we got Robert AFC East, and Chris AFC West. Two first, and we'll do 24 next. All righty. Got a little bit more hats, but it might be a jersey, Steven. Feels like a jersey. It is a jersey. Oh, nope, it's a football, actually. Just kidding. We got a football here. Okay. Uh, let's see who we got. We've got the Amon Green, Green Bay Packer, all-time leading rusher. Uh, this football, I know, has some issues uh, getting pumped up. Amon Green, beautiful autograph. And there's just some some little marks on the ball. It's not in the cleanest condition. It's a little tough to pump up, but it's a great autograph, a great player. Uh, we have some great Packer dates here as well, Super Bowl champion years. What are you guys doing with the NFC title? So I'm on green, NFC North, Michael Frank. Okay, Michael, he's heating up in this series. Uh, All-time leading rusher for the Packers, Nebraska Cornhusker legend as well. Uh, definitely one of my favorite autographs. Great auto. Yeah, one of my favorites. I mean, maybe behind Curtis Martin. When we first started, Stephen, I said Dermonte Dawson, I'm on green, my two favorites. Then I saw Curtis Martin. I was one over, uh, but this is still up there. Uh, for sure. Okay. We are rolling in the break room. Got one more coming in the double box break. Good news, I've got plenty of sticky notes, but that sticky note thing was supposed to cover me for the whole show. It's gone. It's gone, Steven. 
black and blue. So actually, we're exactly halfway done now, Stephen, uh, in the series. But we have more another. More than halfway. Done. No, more than halfway because we got another. Oh, we did. We did do one other one. Yeah. So. Twenty one. We are halfway, but after this box, we'll be slightly more than halfway. Yes. So. Twenty down. About to be twenty one down. Just nineteen to go in the black and blue. And we've done nineteen this show in less than two hours. Uh, so if you're if you're liking this series, get in because it's going to be out of the room tonight. Uh, there's no way this will be here uh, tomorrow. No way. So cool. Got another mini helmets. Time for the Madden cheat code. Most rushing yards all time among quarterbacks. Most yards per carry. Michael Vick on the Falcons Flash Mini Helmet. Uh, so, beautiful helmet. There's some smudges on the back of the helmet, but not too bad shape in the Michael Vick. That's the NFC South. That is Ryan Hicks taking home MV7. Okay, Ryan. Uh, one of the best quarterbacks of our generation for sure. JSA certified on the Michael Vick. Cool. Like that one. Uh, black and blue, it's off the rails at the moment. Absolutely off the rails here. Let me write this up for Michael and Ryan. You guys are doing your thing right now. There's never a dull moment in the break room, Stephen. Never, never a dull is. moment. See? Let's take... A look at the break page where we're at here. We got ourselves. We're wide open here. So, Stephen, I'm almost tempted to call the show here. I'll give you guys a few more minutes, just a couple of minutes. We want to get into anything else during this program. Uh, we are back here at 7 p.m., though, mm -hmm. just over an hour. Uh, and we will knock out the rest of that series tonight. And who was the last hit right there? Michael Vick or Ryan Hicks. Nice. So. Nicely done. Michael Foster already hopping in. Uh, so, guys, I'll give you a, a few more minutes here. We close up another break. We'll keep going. Otherwise, we'll regroup for tonight's 7 p.m. show. We are wide open on the breaks. Uh, but I do know the black and blue is probably going to fill up here fairly quickly, Stephen. I would imagine so. Let me see that Tyreek Hill. Uh, have we already done the football one? Says Austin, yes. We did do a football break. Uh, we had the Eric Dickerson coming out. The next football break is active and live. Uh, hit up this show without question. Tyree Kill Eclipse Authentic. That was one for 40 bucks. I think the guy might have had two spots in there, but essentially won the cheetah for 40 bucks. So that is uh, very cool. So let me know, guys, if you want to knock out anything else. We got four spots to go. So, Stephen, here we to go so we're gonna knock out this break here and this should be the last break of the early show i know we're posted if these guys close it out right away we'll do one more but more likely this will be the last break of this show we'll see we'll see three to go in the next black and blue uh two to go two to go okay one to go one okay it's, <laughs> i don't know what to say here steven uh so what we'll box numbers? Uh, two box not, numbers. Not, not, quite, is what yet. We'll not say. quite yet. Not quite okay. yet. But one spot to go. Close enough. Man, that series is relentless at the moment. Black and blue, fourteen already. We have we'll have seventeen boxes left after this one. Yep. This should close out tonight for sure. We have three footballs left, three minis left, three jerseys left. We could have. Four new series in the room tonight. Yes, Three new good. series. My goodness. Uh, that is fantastic. I love it, man. This who's break room is fun. Uh, filled up? Listen, who's going to close it out? Oh, who's going to close it out? One spot to go? Yeah, I know we're not going to be leaving this one. No, this one's going to happen for sure. One spot to go. What you guys got? Who's going to close out this bad boy uh, in the... Double box break of the black and blue. So Devonte Adams is still out there. Barry Sanders, Derrick Henry, and Brian Dawkins. Four headliners left in that series. Looks like the hero is Mr. Adam Cantwell. All right, Adam, get in there, man. Uh, give me two box numbers, guys. Black and blue, 14. 
two box numbers let's go let's go let's go let's go absolutely fantastic man uh this is just wild how much fun we're having today Vinny got a personal uh is that in black and blue he got a personal he might have okay so Vinny wants 26 on his personal uh yeah that, that works Vinny. and once we get to about 10 boxes there we're gonna take the personals off with how quickly that's selling oh good uh we haven't had a personal yet in that series i almost forgot we offered personals in it but i guess we do i guess we do chris wants 23 and 25 the michael jordan and mark mcguire boxes so both of those going off the ticker I guess when you get Vinny's personal, if you want to bring in a few more, if you can, yep, Steven. I can. I'll put 27, 28, 29, and 30 on there for now, because you know 26 is going on Vinny's personal. So Michael, Sean, Nick, Chris, add them all in here. We'll go eight clicks. Good luck, everybody. Uh, let's see some heat here. Man. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. I guess it makes sense. For 40 bucks in a double box break, it's worth it, right? It makes sense. Yes, sir. Here you go. OJ. The juice is on the loose. Not sure what this is. I'll go eight clicks here. Listen for the pizza guy banging on the door, says Vinny. Okay, Vinny. <laughs> oh man not how this office is set up not how the office is set up nick boyer nfc north we got chris leonard in the nfc south it's michael foster nfc east nick nfc west adam afc north michael afc south sean afc east and michael afc west 23 and 25 here we go out of 40 Filling up like crazy. Got a mini helmet here. Ooh, it's a good one. Where's David Honga at, man? Uh, we have Warren Moon. It's on a Chief mini helmet. Nine-time Pro Bowler, Pro Football Hall of Famer, Canadian Football League Hall of Famer. That is Beckett certified. Warren Moon on the Chiefs helmet this time. Michael Francia, congratulations on Mr. Moon. All right, Michael. Uh, let's see. What is wrong with this? Suppo supposedly. Let me take a peek at what our page says. Warren Moon on the Chief, Stephen. Nice. Uh, we have, let's see. Warren Moon. A paint issue, it says. Okay. Hmm. Maybe the back, it's like slightly more dark right there maybe the paint issue is there but pretty good shape uh mr francia with the dub okay <laughs> gonna close out this series tonight came it went bye bye we're in moon one more coming in the double box break let's see what we got here that's Vinny's personal, right? Yes. We'll do a personal as well next. Up the mini here. Box 25. What could we have here in 25 out of 40? Just moving and grooving in the series. Absolute heat. Another mini helmet. Ooh, okay. Well, there was two of these in the series, right, Steven? So. We, we pulled one earlier. Here's the other one. Matt Hasselback. Oh, okay. So I believe there was some sort of paint chip issue on this one as well. Some discoloration. Some discoloration. I know we have a little mark here as well. So Matt Hasselback, a couple minor scratches. Uh, very solid quarterback for the Seahawks. Uh, helped them get to the Super Bowl against the Steelers that one season. Uh, really good player. A uh, very underrated quarterback in the 2000s. Uh, Three-time Pro Bowler as well. 
Uh, he had more than 36,000 passing yards, 212 passing touchdowns. NFC West, Nick Boyer taking home the hassle back. Okay, Nick. Okay, Nick, we see you. Nicely done, sir. I love the doubles. I love how they're working. It was a great idea to go to the double, Steven. Yes, it was. It's, it moves much quicker. Moves much quicker. Uh, Cameron, that was actually Warren Moon on the Chiefs helmet. Played for a bunch of teams, the Vikings, the Seahawks, and also the Chiefs, among other teams. Played in the CFL. Man was truly all over the place. Really good wherever he went. He was good everywhere. So Vinny's personal is next. 26 on the way. Let's see here. Thank you, Steven. Sweet, says Michael. So Vinny, I know, is in here. These were personals from yesterday. But I know, Vinny, that did come through, right, Steven, on the order sheet? Yes. Perfect. Black, uh, black and blue. Maybe. Yeah, black and blue. Vincent Patani. I would trade for that Perry jersey from earlier, says Cameron. Okay. Be a decent trade. I think we got a football here, Steven. Vinny's taking home a football. We got ourselves. Well, this is not bad. It's kind of fitting. Vinny's a Michigan guy. The 1982 Big Ten MVP, Anthony Carter. Three-time Pro Bowler in the NFL. He was a great uh, returner in college. Returned kicks. A uh, great receiver as well. Uh, nicely done on the Anthony Carter football, Vinny. That works out pretty good. Let's see what's wrong with it, supposedly. Because it looks in pretty good shape to me. Anthony Carter football. Uh, we've got, let's see. I don't even see it in here, Steven. Am I blind? Oh, it is. Inflation issues. So I guess it's hard to pump up. Looks pretty pumped up to me, man. I don't know, Vinny. You might have just gotten a good Anthony Carter Michigan football. Then he's saying, I'll take it. JSA certified on the Anthony Carter, Vinny. Not bad. Not bad. Michigan item for a Michigan fan. Vinny! Eastern Michigan game about to go final, by the way, Steven. Get myself a bet. A winning bet, that is. All righty. Refreshing the break page. Let's see here. All right, I'll tell you what, Steven. We're going to take our dinner break. We're going to do one more break. We got two spots to go. Then we're going to refresh for tonight's 7 p.m. show. One spot to go. So this will be the last break of the show. Uh, the black and blue football mixer double box break. And then we'll close out the series tonight. Okay, sounds good. So that's the, the plan for now. Uh, 28 says, Vinny, one more box number, guys. And 27. Okay, 27. 28. Going off the ticker here in the black and blue. Steven, now it's going to be, what, 15 boxes left, I think? Yeah, about, roughly. So we're going to open up all the boxes tonight. Uh, can we kill a too large? I think Steven and I can kill it, right, Steven? Yeah. I know you've been eating a little healthier of late, but I think... I can't get inspired. Yeah. Put that... Put can't get that, inspired for the cause. Put that to bed, yeah. Steven. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes uh, you got to revert back to old ways. That's right. Uh, so black and blue, this is... A My wife's going to be jealous. Yeah, she will be jealous. <laughs> Pete too My girlfriend pizza. will be jealous We had pizza well. last night, but I don't care. Can, We're back. You can never go wrong with pizza. We're back. Be back, baby. So let me know, guys, on a couple box numbers here. Still get it ready. Hold on. Oh, you're good, Steven. Oh, we do have the boxes. Never mind. 27 and 28. Those are already off the ticker. Thank you, Vinny. I hope so, Vinny. It's coming up right at that time, too. Uh, so... Don't worry, I'll be keeping an eye out here. So this is the last one, so it's ready for you. Yeah, 604, 6 to 614. Okay, that's fine. Eight clicks here. Robert down the Vinny. Good luck, folks. 27, 28. Let's see some heat. Literally the last. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Can I have me some boxes? Yes, I certainly can. Yeah, we'll just bring them all in, Steven, tonight, so you don't have to go back there. I know we know we're going to close the series, yeah. so we might as well preemptively bring all the boxes in for tonight's show. 
six, seven, and eight. All right, Michael Frank up top in the NFC North. We've got Robert Alvarado in the NFC South. It's Colin NFC East, Chris NFC West, Vinny AFC North, Christopher AFC South, Michael AFC East, and Colin AFC West. Seven and 28. We'll start with 27 first. What could we have in here? Come on. What do we got? Let's see that Henry says Chris Ventura. Okay, Chris. He's calling his shot. Derek Henry, one of the best running backs in the NFL. Got a good one instead. It's actually Colin Pelletier. Going to take home a headliner. Brian Dawkins. Look at this. Uh, one of the best defensive players of all time. Legendary safety on the Eagles jersey. Uh, let me take a peek at what's supposedly wrong with this. Because Brian Dawkins' jersey... Looks pretty good to me. Uh, let's see. What does the listing say? Brian Dawkins. Stains on the jersey, apparently. Okay. I guess there's a it's slight a stain. Right oh, there's a stain at the bottom. That's what it is. Yeah, he pulled that up. A small little stain at the bottom. You can actually cover that up if you mm -hmm. frame it, potentially. Frame it right. So, nine-time Pro Bowler, NFL 2000s, All-Decade Team. One of the best safeties of all time, Brian Dawkins' jersey. Okay, it's not bad. Uh, congratulations, Colin, with the NFC East. Little roll for Colin here, B Doc. We got one more box on the way. Uh, gonna be the last break of this show. We're gonna take a small dinner break. Vinny's Pizza's about to get here, then we'll regroup for tonight. It's 7 p.m. Central Time. Uh, there is no deadline tonight at 7. We've been here till midnight before, 1 a.m. before. As long as orders are coming in, we'll break boxes. And I can say, say this, Stephen. This series should sell out in the, within the first hour, so we can take our attention to some other series tonight as well. So fire. Like Loaded Dice with the Peyton Manning out mm -hmm. there. Uh, that could be a good one as well. The other Colin would love that. He would. Uh, our own Colin Rudisso would absolutely love that hit. Cameron saying, I know, long shot, Warren Moon for the fridge. Asking again. Doesn't hurt to ask. Actually, that's a pretty, I would say that's actually not a bad deal. Uh, they're both great players. Warren Moon's a quarterback and he's better. Yeah. So that's not a bad trade. I, I don't know if that's a long shot. I might take that trade. I, I probably won't as a Bear fan, but if I wasn't a Bear fan, I don't know. One more here. We got 28 coming up. Let's see what we got in 28 out of 40. Show me some heat here. Out of Jersey. The Jersey type of break. Oh, well, how about this? We got another fridge. This time, Ooh. William Perry on a team we know him best for. Chicago Fire. Bear, William Perry jersey. That right there is beautiful. Michael Frank. We don't typically have the same guy in a series more than once, except for this series. Only exception. Congrats, Michael, on the William Perry jersey. The fridge. Okay. Okay, that's not bad. Let's see what's wrong with this one. No cert card, otherwise perfect condition on the fridge. Uh, he gets it anyway, he says. He's the one looking for it. And you got the better one, Michael. All due respect to Clemson, the fridge on the Bears is even better. Who needs a trade when you can get the jersey anyway? William Perry. Michael, Michael. Uh, that is very cool, man. Uh, very cool. Is that a different guy? It's actually Michael Frank is different. Michael Francia is Cameron Franks. That's a different guy. Yeah, it's a different guy, actually, isn't it? I think Michael Frank's the chief fan. Yeah. Michael Francia goes by Cameron Frank on Facebook. Uh -huh. Very confusing. I think it's a different guy. I think it's a different guy. We got Colin Pelletier saying, yeah, we can do it. Uh, he says, yes. 
Okay, so I guess we could flip those stickers, right? They want to trade uh, William Perry Clemson jersey for the Warren Moon mini helmet, Stephen. Okay, hold on. I will trade Moon for Fridge, says Cameron. Uh, Colin says, yes, we can do it. So we'll make that adjustment for you guys, like I said. Between Colin and Michael? Yes, Colin and Michael. Colin says confirmed. We, Colin with, wants to give up what? The William Perry jersey? The Clemson one. Okay. Well, I, think, Perry, I think we'll have one. Well, we just got yeah. a William Perry jersey, right? Right. We have the, the, the Clemson one, the one from yep. earlier today. Mm -hmm. Okay, done. Confirmed. We can only do it if it's in the same break. Uh, that way we can flip the stickers before the shipping stickers department too. gets on it. What's up? That's creating new stickers, too. Okay. Sounds good. We'll definitely do that. I think that's a good stopping off point here, guys. Uh, what an excellent show. Two hours and ten minutes. Uh, we have the double box break ready for tonight's 7 p.m. show. Uh, we'll see you guys here in about 50 minutes, Stephen. Yeah. Holy moly, Billy, Vinny saying go get that pizza. I agree. Looking forward to eating that pizza tonight. So, guys, 4 and 7 Central Time, Monday through Friday, 2 and 7 Central Time on Saturdays and Sundays. We will have all the boxes available in the black and blue tonight. So, right off the bat, we can get all those headliners you guys want. We'll see you in about 50 minutes. Uh, thank you very much, guys, on a fantastic show. Uh, I love these guys, Steven. Yeah, the best, best customers in the business. We'll see you in 50 minutes.